What up YouTube, this is Sneed from Sneed Mobile Tech with a video for you guys today. And I have some news on a promotion that's going to be starting in the coming days. And the promotion is from T-Mobile. And it's kind of an interesting promotion. It looks like it's going to be geared specifically to snagging Verizon customers. Trying to get uh, Verizon subs switched over to the T-Mobile side. So uh, there's quite a few details. There's some things I want to mention. And a couple of fine print items that you have to know before considering the switch. Uh, so let me go ahead and scroll down on some details. Uh, the first thing is the promotion does start May 31st, and they're going to be calling it the Get Out of the Red promotion. So this is going to be specifically targeted to users on the Verizon side. Uh, you know, looking at some of the initial details when I first looked at it, I thought it was a really, really good deal, and it is, but there's a couple of things to know. So one of the key restrictions is hardware. There's only a certain set of specific cell phones that qualify, and uh, it looks like it's restricted to iPhones and the more recent ones, so the iPhone SE, the 6S, the 6S Plus, and then the iPhone 7 and 7 Plus. The other two phones that qualify are the Google Pixel and the Google Pixel XL, so unless you have one of those phones, uh, you won't be able to qualify for this offer. Uh, they're saying it's a software thing. It is. It actually is a software restriction, but it's... It's also kind of a hardware restriction, and I'll talk more about that when I get to the, the Sprint and the AT&T side. Uh, so, you know, in order to qualify for it, you have to have those devices. Also, when you do the switch from Verizon to T-Mobile, you are automatically going to be enrolled in the T-Mobile's Premium Device Protection Plus, which actually isn't a bad thing. The only problem is, is if you didn't want that service, it's not really an option. It's something that's mandatory in the switch. So it's a $15 fee per month, but it covers lost and stolen. If you have an iPhone, it includes Apple Care. You know, there's some other reasons to have it as well, like uh, damages and everything. It's definitely worth the $15, but if you didn't want to pay it, you know, you're kind of stuck paying it, so you don't really have a choice there. Um, the way that the kickback is going to work is you have to switch with the phone, t mobiles going to pay off your phone, and it's going to be coming back in the form of a prepaid MasterCard, and it's going to take 15 to 30 days. So that could be two weeks, and that could be the full month. So, But that's kind of nice that it's coming back pretty quickly. Some rebates can take months, and of course, we all know how those bill credits work and how much we hate them. Uh, so those are some of the details from the Switch. Uh, now, as, as I stated earlier, there is going to be a Sprint and AT&T version of this, but there are some restrictions to it, only because... You know, Sprint and AT&T usually lock their phones until they're fully paid off. So I'm, I have a feeling that that's going to be kind of a, an issue, a snag there. And um, so that's going to be a little bit tougher on the Switch. But they are going to be offering a Switch uh, from those uh, carriers as well. Um, now, here's something interesting. Starting uh, this week as well, you can actually get a really good deal from the Switch on your lines. So what they're doing is if you port, uh, port multiple numbers you can actually get some really good deals on the service. So the way I guess it works is if you port over two numbers, say there are two voice lines, you can get two voice lines or data lines free. You won't get charged for them or it's some kind of two for one. So the details are, I've kind of seen this differently from different sources. I think I'm actually going to go into the T-Mobile store and ask for clarification on this to see if it's a two for one on the two lines or if it's going to be two free lines because you're porting over the two lines. I have a feeling it's a free line per line that you port. So port one, get one free. Port a second, get another one free. I think that's how it's kind of working. That could be great. That could save you a ton of money. You know, if your Verizon bill is, you know, $250 a month or $300 a month, this could bring it down potentially to 100 some dollars, even after the taxes and the fees are included. So I'll ask and I'll kind of check into it and I'll kind of report back to you guys to see exactly what the deal is. Uh, now, there are a couple of more restrictions that come with the Switch. I was able to find some details. You are going to have to enroll in the T-Mobile One plan. Uh, I guess you have to have a pre-existing service with Verizon uh, for at least 60 days. Uh, I think you also have to stay with T-Mobile for a certain number of days to qualify. Uh, so there are some restrictions and things that still have to be ironed out. I have to find out what they are, and then I can report back to you guys. In the meantime, if you guys have any details on this and you've seen the promotion... 
Go ahead and report to me through the comments. Let me know what you guys think of the deal. Let me know if you're considering switching from Verizon to T-Mobile. And uh, I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments. Anyways, thanks for watching the video. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.